am I willing to not just do this to me, but to do this to my mom and to do this to my dad as the only son in our family? These are the issues I'm wrestling with and it's hurting and that's why I'm asking God for more dreams, more visions, asking him to give me more and more. But at a certain point, enough's enough and the Lord stopped giving me more and so that's when I realized I had to do what I had to do. But I couldn't quite do it. Um, Like I said, I met David my freshman year of college. By this point, I was in my my second year of grad school. So this took years to get to this point. And as I was driving to school one day, I just started bawling, I just started crying. And I said, God, I know what I have to do, but I need time to mourn. I need time to mourn. Uh, I do think that there is enough evidence in this world for us to conclude that God exists. I think it is the most rational conclusion. Uh, But how much can we know about God after that point? I think revelation is necessary to know the deeper things about God. And this is one of them, that God is three in one. We have eternity to worship God in bliss. We have eternity to live joyfully without pain. We have this short life, a blink of an eye, to preach Christ. My aunt uh, passed away two days ago. Right when I landed here, I found out that she passed away. She lives in Cambridge, lived in Cambridge. She's been in Cambridge since the 70s. She's been in our backyard here. I don't think anyone shared the gospel with her. She's Muslim, 